Now make sure that you have some kind of a block as well as some kind of a strap. And this can be either a book or a box or a belt or a scarf. All of those things work. So have a drink of water close by if you need it and let's go ahead and begin. Come into a comfortable seated position. Close your eyes and slowly begin to deepen your breath. Feel the breath lengthen, feel the breath move through body. And then begin to switch your breath over to the ujjayi breath, this real big yoga breath done with a light constriction in the back of the throat that causes your breath to sound like a really loud whisper. If there was somebody next to you, they could hear you breathing. Our intent for these next 20 minutes is to connect down into low belly, low back. So to really push the breath down into low belly, low back, and then expand the rib cage out to the sides. So place one hand on low belly, one hand on low back, and send breath down into the space between your hands. On the exhale, draw low belly in towards spine, get all the air out, feel the support that gives to low back. Now bring hands to side rib cage. You can either have the elbows out to the side or cross the body to get hands on either side of the ribs. Inhale, send breath down into low belly, low back, and then at the top of your inhale, expand ribs out to the sides. So really work with this kind of breath through today's practice. Seated spinal twist one leg out. Bring your left leg out, right foot is over the left thigh. Bring your right hand behind the right hip. Inhale, lengthen spine tall. Exhale, hug the knee and move into the twist. Now keep your chin in line with chest here. Oftentimes we like to pull and turn with our neck. Just really allow yourself to stay soft. You're just beginning to feel into body, open into body. You want to feel the movement and space that you create with your breath. So inhale down into mid back, back rib cage. Expand back ribs out and then exhale slowly move into the space you created with the breath. Inhale, come back to center and switch sides. Right leg is out, left foot over right thigh. Left hand behind the left hip, inhale, lengthen spine tall, press hand into ground to help lift. Exhale, hug the knee and move into the twist. Send breath down into low back, side ribs. Remember to keep that chin in line with chest and just allow your breath to lead this organic opening. Inhale, come back to center, and then lay down on your mat for abdominals. So the first abdominal we're going to do is just a toe tap abdominal. So your legs are at right angles here, and just bring hands to low belly or onto the ground. Inhale, down into low back. Curl tailbone up, press low back down into the floor. Exhale, toe tap left foot down. Pull belly to spine, draw the foot back up. 
So you're just beginning to connect to these very deep internal abdominal muscles. Deep inhale, curl tailbone up, press low back down. Exhale, toe tap right foot down, pull belly to spine, draw foot back up. Keep low back pressed to the floor. Inhale, release the pelvis. Low back can lift up if it feels natural. Curl tailbone up, press low back down. Exhale, toe tap left foot down. Draw belly to spine, pull left foot back up. Inhale, release the pelvis. Curl tailbone up, press low back down. Exhale, right foot down. Pull belly to spine, draw the right foot back up. And release down. Bring hands to low belly, breathe into the space under your hands. Alternating thigh press with one leg straight. So bring your right hand to left thigh. Legs start at right angles and then straighten the right leg up to the ceiling. Inhale down into low back. Exhale, curl tailbone up. Push hand into thigh, thigh into hand. Pull belly down to spine. Reach the ball of the right foot up to the ceiling. Inhale, switch legs. Left hand to right thigh. Exhale, curl tailbone up. Push hand into thigh, thigh into hand. Pull belly down to spine. Reach the ball of the left foot up to the ceiling. Inhale, switch legs. Right hand to left thigh. Exhale, curl tailbone up. Push hand into thigh, thigh into hand. Pull belly down to spine. Relax into neck and jaw. Inhale, switch legs, left hand to right thigh. Exhale, curl tailbone up, push hand into thigh, thigh into hand. Pull belly down to spine, draw pelvic floor up. Inhale and release down, bring feet to the ground. Again, just put hands onto low belly, low back and breathe into space under your hands. Laying down spinal twist. Bring your knees up to chest and then let your knees fall over to the left side of the body. You want to make sure your knees are high enough up so they're about belly button height so you can create a lot of space into low back. Right arm is on the ground by your head. And just look up to the ceiling. Have your face pointing to the ceiling so you're not, again, you're not pulling with your head or neck. Send the breath down into low belly, low back, and then feel the side ribs expand. Bring arms out into goal pose. Bring top leg up first and then the other. And then switch to the other side. Draw knees up to chest. Bring knees over to the right side of the body. Left arm is on the ground by your head. Lengthen tailbone down and just breathe through the entire left side of body all the way down into low back. Just slowly beginning to open the body up to feel and connect. Bring arms out into goal pose. Bring top leg up first and then the other. Elbow to knee. So elbow to knee is a really classic forest yoga abdominal. Do this nice and slow with my cueing. Hands clasp behind the head, elbows wrap to ceiling to create a nice basket for your head and neck to rest in. Bring legs up at right angles. Feet just below the knees. Inhale down into low back. Lift head and shoulders up off the mat. Hold the breath, press top of sacrum down, curl tailbone up. Exhale, head and shoulders to left knee. Right leg reaches out at a 45 degree angle from the floor. 
Pull belly down to spine. Make sure that left knee stays over the left hip. Inhale, come back to center. Bend both legs. Hold the breath. Press top of sacrum down. Curl tailbone up. Exhale, head and shoulders to right knee. Left leg reaches out. Pull belly down to spine. Lift up with both shoulder blades if it feels possible. Inhale, come back to center. Bend both legs. Hold the breath, press top of sacrum down, curl tailbone up. Exhale, head and shoulders to left knee, right leg reaches out. Pull belly down to spine, reach thigh away from hip. Inhale, come back to center, bend both legs. Hold the breath, press top of sacrum down, curl tailbone up. Exhale, head and shoulders to right knee, left leg reaches out. Pull belly down to spine. Reach thigh away. Inhale, come back to center. Bend both legs. Hold the breath. Press top of sacrum down. Curl tailbone up. Exhale, head and shoulders to left knee. Right leg reaches out. Pull belly down to spine. We're really getting these muscles in the abdominals that support your, your skeletal system. Inhale, come back to center. Bend both knees. Hold the breath. Press top of sacrum down. Curl tailbone up. Exhale, head and shoulders to right knee. Left leg reaches out. Pull belly down to spine. Inhale and release down. Bring soles of feet together, knees apart. And just reach arms up overhead. Breathe into your core. Just notice the breath. Notice if it feels different after waking up the abdominals and connecting to your core. Roll over onto your belly. For low cobra here, just to lengthen out those abdominal muscles, reach both legs away from you. You can have elbows on the ground or up slightly. Lengthen tailbone down, reach legs away, and then use your hands and forearms to pull chest forward. So you really feel for the lengthening of the abdominal muscles that you just turned on. Deep inhale, expand ribs. Exhale, scoop down. Come up into down dog and then come up to standing. Step your feet forward to hands. Twisting horse stance. Sink into your horse. Feet are wide apart. Bring your left forearm on your left thigh. Right hand is to the inside of the right thigh. Straighten the right arm and curve your torso over to the left thigh and knee. Press down through the feet, spread the toes. Inhale, send breath down into low belly, low back as you reach sit bones back. Feel for the space and length through right side of torso and into the right hip. Inhale, bring torso up, switch sides. Right forearm on the right thigh, left hand to the inside of the left thigh. Make sure it's not on the knee, keep it on the inside of the thigh. Straighten the left arm and curve torso towards the right knee and thigh. Inhale, expand the breath through left rib cage all the way down to the left hip. Exhale, use your left hand to traction the thigh bone away from hip. Inhale, reach sit bones back. Inhale, come on up, straighten the legs. And then turn your feet so that they are pointing toes straight ahead so you're in a straddle stance. And grab your block. So this is a straddle with a thoracic twist. 
bring your block and just place it down in front of you about in the middle of your legs and then bring one hand onto the block. You want your back to be pretty parallel with the ground and perpendicular or at a right angle, excuse me, at a right angle with your torso and legs. So you don't wanna be, it's not a forward fold. With that right hand pressing down into the block, lift left arm to the ceiling. Really notice what's happening in the hips. Do your, your hips shift as you try and twist with the hips? Keep those hips really neutral. That might mean you don't twist as much. Exhale, come down. Inhale, right arm up. Press left hand down into the block. Bring right arm down, left arm up. Inhale, open up. Exhale. Down, right arm up. Again, feel what's happening in the hips. Exhale, down. Inhale, left arm up. Reach sit bones back and feel the breath open through side ribs. Exhale, down. Inhale, right arm up. Exhale, down. Inhale, left arm up. Exhale down, inhale right arm up and just feel the subtle change with each twist. Exhale down. Bring your back knee to the ground. So I have my right leg forward, no excuse me, my left leg forward, my right knee to the ground. Inhale arms up, exhale twist. So my left arm is twisting back, right arm is forward. Inhale up, exhale twist. Inhale up, expand back ribs, side ribs. Exhale twist, hips stay neutral so you're just twisting through the mid spine. Inhale up. Exhale, twist over to the side. Bring arms down, switch legs. Right leg forward, left knee is to the ground. Make sure you have a stable base here. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, twist. Left arm forward, right arm back. Inhale, arms up. Expand ribs, exhale, twist to the side. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, twist. Reach out through active hands. Spread the fingers. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, twist. Inhale, arms up. And then bring arms down. Come into a cross-legged position and grab your strap. You may need it. Just a seated spinal twist to end our time here. Bring your left hand to right knee and then reach your right hand behind your back. Start with the fingertips on the ground. Inhale, lengthen spine tall and then exhale into the twist. No forcing here, keep chin in line with chest. And then if you feel like you have more space, then you can reach the right hand behind your back. From here, you might be able to grab onto your hip crease or your waistband, or use that strap. Put the strap around your knee and shin and reach around with that right hand to grab onto the strap. This is a modification that you can take should you need it. Inhale, expand back ribs, exhale into the twist. Inhale, come back to center and switch sides. Switch that strap if you're using it. 
Right hand on the left knee, left hand starts on the ground behind your left hip. Inhale, lengthen spine tall. Exhale, move into the twist. And if you have the space to move further, left hand behind the back to grab onto hip crease, waistband, or clothing, or grab onto the strap. Inhale, send breath down into low belly, low back, and then expand the ribs out to the sides. Inhale, come back to center. Come into Baddha Konasana, now soles of feet together, knees apart for just a quick forward fold here, here in Baddha Konasana. Lengthen out the low back. Inhale, lengthen spine, press sit bones down into the floor, and then walk your hands forward as much as you can. You can stay with your hands on your shins or walk your hands to the ground. Press sit bones down and energetically reach them back. Press feet into one another, spread toes. Inhale, send breath down into low back. Soften through shoulders and neck. Inhale, come on up. Hands to heart center. Take a deep breath and just feel what you did for yourself here today. Namaste. Thank you guys for joining me today for the Move With Me. Christina will be on next week's Move With Me. And these are recorded and also then uploaded to our Vimeo channel and YouTube channel. So you can always find it there or on Instagram, IGTV. Thanks and have a great day, everyone.